morning you guys it is friday morning happy friday to everyone um i wanted to pick up the camera today and show you guys what i eat in a day i'm trying to do a strict low carb day today no matter the temptation and what i'm craving because i haven't done a low carb day in a while and i think this will definitely be good for me yesterday uh we went out to the park and we went for a walk we raced we ran we played tag and um, i'm a little sore today but it feels so good because i have not worked out in so long i've been doing stretches but i haven't like been to the gym or like i haven't ran or anything like that so it felt good to get out the house yesterday and do that so anyway um this morning i am gonna make a bacon i don't know if i'm gonna add cheese but a bacon and egg sandwich on a bagel and i have so many sola breads in my freezer i have bagels and i have um the sweet oat bread so i took some sola bread out last night so we're gonna make that and also you guys okay so you guys know that i work with perfect keto i love all of their products um i was taking the keto collagen and adding this to my coffee and my smoothies but I heard when you're pregnant you shouldn't take collagen so I haven't taken any collagen for I don't know about six weeks now um, but they sent me a new vanilla I think this is vanilla yeah vanilla keto collagen that I probably won't use because I still have so much in mine so I want to send this to one of you guys so if you guys have been wanting to try um, keto collagen in the vanilla flavor by perfect keto please let me know leave me a comment I will mail this to you guys and maybe I'll add some little goodies in there as well so yeah so just leave a comment let me know if you guys want to try it um and if there's multiple of you guys i will try my best to get some more keto collagen and i'll send that to you but for now i just want to send this to someone because um i'm not going to be using it so i have some of this turkey bacon that jamal actually picked up and i put four pieces in the air fryer so this is cured turkey bacon which i usually don't get this kind but i mean still looks really good so in the air fryer per usual and then i'm gonna toast some of this sola bread this is the everything uh bread seven grams of net carbs so i'm gonna go ahead and toast that So I'm gonna try to make like a over hard egg because as you guys know, I can't have uncooked eggs, which I truly miss my over medium eggs and my dippy eggs. Anyway, I'm gonna try to cook this um, as much as possible until the inside is um, completely done and hard. And then I'm gonna add it to my bagel. All right, today I'm just gonna use regular cream cheese. This has two grams of carbs per two tablespoons. So I'm gonna use about one tablespoon. Okay, my over hard egg I'm going to add right on top there. We're gonna add two pieces of the turkey bacon. I think I, oh, I did it backwards. <laughs> Okay, just to add some greens, I'm gonna add one of these green leaves that I get from Walmart, and that's it. This will be my breakfast this morning. Just a simple bacon and cheese sandwich on a everything Sola bread bagel. Let me cut this in half. So, look at that, the egg came out perfect it's an over hard egg so it's fully cooked for me so i can eat it and enjoy it so oh and i've just really been like wanting cream cheese on a bagel so that's why i added regular cream cheese today usually i would add the um what's it called the vegetable garden cream cheese so
So I wanted to show you guys these color changing confetti Starbucks cups that I got from Starbucks. Guys, this was such a good price. So you get, this is like a venti. So you get five of these. So they come with straws, the confetti cups, the tops, and they usually bring this out every spring so you don't see it in Starbucks um, every, every day throughout the year. Um, so I'm so glad I was able to get this because these run out pretty quick. I cannot get this out, hold on guys. So yeah, so right now these cups look like they're just like clear. Um, and they have, and then I have another one in there that's being stubborn, but um, they have confetti on them. And I got the cold ones. And they also have cups for um, hot drinks as well. So when you put ice or anything cold in here, um, the confetti will change colors and then it will reveal what color it is. So it says, just add ice to reveal the color of your confetti. And then... There's like red, like a blue, mint, pink, green, and purple. So I'm actually gonna use this one today for um, my water. I'm gonna add some ice and some cold water, and then we'll see what color it turns. Oh, and then it was only $19.99 for five cups. So essentially these were, oh, that's dirty. So essentially, these were uh, about $4 each. So that is not a bad price. If you were to buy these individually, like with obviously without the confetti, because they don't have that throughout the year. But if you were to buy one cup, it's like $9.99. So I think five of them for $19.99 is such a good price. So I do want to get the whole or the hot um, cups as well. But I'm going to wait for like a week or two because I don't know. I just got these, so. Oh, looks like the confetti is turning purple. How cool is that? Wow. And I actually grabbed this top um, before I knew that it was purple. But look how cute. That is so cute for spring and for summer, just to have like a nice cold drink. Um, and then I have one of these cups already and they do keep my um, My beverages cold and icy so I'll let you guys know how long this ice will remain ice in here But it's so cute you guys you guys should go get a pack so cute So it's one o'clock. This is my third cup of water for the day. This is definitely helping me drink more water I personally love drinking water through a straw. I think that makes me drink more water. And since it's like such a new cup, I'm just so excited to like use it, but we'll see how long this lasts. So it's such a beautiful day out. I'm gonna check and see what the temperature. It's 68 degrees here in Pittsburgh. And I tried to go out earlier just to sit in the sun. I have a beautiful deck here um, that we need to repaint, by the way, that you're gonna see how crazy it looks um, on the wood. But um, so beautiful, but those damn bees. I know a lot of you guys said that they were, you know, not harmful, but I'm just so scared because they get so close to me and I'm just like, oh, I don't know. Oh, it's such a beautiful day out. Oh, it's so hot. I love it. It feels so good. I'm gonna sit down in my chair. Looks so nice out. This is like the first nice day in a while here in Pittsburgh. But last summer, I remember just putting um, tanning oil on me and putting a towel on our wood, or not the wood, but the floor on our deck and I would just tan and it just felt so, so good. It feels so good right now, you guys. But I, um, I'm gonna grab a snack in a little bit and then I have to go and get Micah from school. He actually went on a field trip today. He was so excited. They went to a little, like, um, I don't know. It's not like a real farm, but it's like one of those like outdoor things um, that has a farm and a playground and they have like a, a, a bee area where you can learn about bees and stuff. So it's really cool. Um, his last day of school is on Monday. So <sighs> summer vacation is going to be starting pretty soon. But all right, I'm just going to sit out here for a little just to get some 
sun and then I'm gonna go back inside get my laundry from the basement and just get some work done and then grab a snack so I'll show you guys what I have for a snack okay quick snack I grabbed two little slim gyms we have like a whole huge pack of these from Sam's I think there was like a hundred in there um, but I love snacking on these so good and low carb and then I have this is the last one in my four pack these are the chili lime flavored tortilla protein chips by quest I love this one guys Jamal and Micah love these as well there's only three grams of net carbs her pack so I'm gonna take this upstairs sorry I'm out of breath because I went downstairs to grab my laundry <sighs> and now I'm out of breath so I'm gonna take this my iced water with me upstairs and have this as a snack How was your field trip? Good. Good? Fun. Fun? What'd you do? I did a play on the field. Okay, let me see this. I did a car. <laughs> you played at the playground? Did you see the bees? Yeah. Did you see animals? I didn't see no bees, but, but animals. Animals? Okay. You hungry? Yeah. Okay. I mean, no. Yes or no? No. Okay. See me. Yes, they can. So how? Tell everyone how your field trip was. was yes, it fun? we see much stuff. No, you can. So I think we are gonna go and get lunch. J um, I was gonna say Jamal. Micah is not hungry, so he says. Oh, no, so I'm just gonna go to Wendy's and get a salad. I'll probably give him something so he can have it for dinner but yeah I'm just gonna do like a simple salad for lunch and then um, for dinner I'll make something for dinner at home so yeah let's go get some All right, you guys we're home so I got the Parmesan chicken Caesar salad I think is what it's called and it does come with these little Parmesan crisps which are amazing those are my favorite and then it comes with this um, Caesar dressing. So this salad only has two, three, two or three grams of net carbs. I was just looking at it, but I couldn't remember because it had fiber in it. So I don't remember if it was a total of three grams of net carbs or two. Anyway, um, either way, this is such a great and filling lunch to have this dressing i believe has two grams of net carbs let me look yep two grams of net carbs so i mean you're and then this obviously has no carbs so everything here is under five grams of net carbs and this is a huge salad i don't know if you guys can see i need to get my nails done you guys my nails done i can't talk today but all right i'm gonna go ahead and have this i'm gonna put micah down for a nap he didn't take a nap today at school because he went on a field trip so i'm gonna do that and then i'm gonna come down and have my salad but let me just kind of show you guys it's such a simple salad and i think this was only six dollars so it's just grilled cheese with um romaine lettuce and then your Parmesan crisp and your Caesar salad. This is something that I would 100% make at home, but I don't have any chicken or Parmesan um, crisp or any lettuce right now, so it was just quicker just to pick everything up at Wendy's. So, this is my lunch. All right, guys, I am gonna go ahead and start dinner. It is 6.15. Um, so I'm gonna try to get this done before Jamal gets home, but um, we're all gonna eat this for dinner. It's pretty simple, it's easy, it is keto friendly. So let me show you real quick what I have. All right, so I am gonna make this cilantro lime chicken. This is the Kevin's Natural Food brand. I got this from Fresh Time about a week ago. And just to check out carbs there's four grams of carbs per five ounces so that is pretty darn good it looks really good mm. 
Okay, and then for my sides, I am just gonna be making rice cauliflower and some vegetables. This is the broccoli like medley that I get from Sam's. It has orange carrots, yellow carrots, broccoli, and cauliflower, but it also just comes in this little thing. And then the rice cauliflower is also from Sam's. I had about 10 of these just sitting in the freezer, so very convenient. I'm gonna make this on the stove, and I'm also gonna make this on the stove, um, and then I'll make this last because it's literally ready in five minutes. I just throw it in the microwave. So let's go ahead and make the sides first and then chicken. So for the veggies, I add salt and pepper. I didn't do that yet, but all I add is this garlic butter. I always talk about this. This is from Sam's. It's the Chef Chamois garlic butter. This in the vegetables, guys, oh my goodness, it will change your life so so good and makes everything like 10 times more tasty so definitely recommend that and the rice cauliflower so simple um it's just cooking right now all i add is salt and pepper and that's it so All right guys, so the directions, very simple. They do want you to kind of massage the chicken a little, um, just so it kind of breaks apart. All right, I'm gonna pour this cilantro lime sauce all over the chicken. Mmm, smells really good. Okay, let's mix this all together. I'm not gonna add any salt or pepper yet. Okay, I'm just gonna wet a paper towel. Put it right on top and then I'm going to throw this in the microwave for two minutes. Alright guys, so what I'm going to do is actually sort of make this into like a bowl. So I have my little cute glass bowl container here. I get this from um, Ikea. It's only like a dollar. Love it. Alright, so we are going to fill this with cauliflower rice. Okay, and then we're gonna add the chicken. All right, and then I'm gonna add the veggies on this side. Okay, look how good this looks. You could definitely meal prep this for your lunch, but I'm gonna add a little bit of hot sauce to the chicken and then we'll have this for dinner. So I'm gonna have a bite with you guys and then I'm gonna sit down and eat dinner with Jamal. When he gets home, he should be home in like 10 minutes, but I'm going to add some of this hot sauce again, just to give it a nice little kick. So, all right, let's try it together. And I like to put everything like in one bite. There we go broccoli, chicken, rice. Mmm. That chicken is so good. Sorry, talking with my mouth full, but that chicken's good. Another bite. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. The chicken, 10 out of 10. Would recommend. That stuff is good. If you like limey cilantro things <laughs> this chicken's really good wow all right one more bite i promise and then i'm gonna save this until jamal gets home jamal has so he was off for five days in a row 
and now he's working like five days in a row so um you know when he's home within those five days where he's working i just try to at least have dinner with him because he's gone for almost 13 hours out of the day so we try to make dinner a little special when he's working like five days in a row so poor guy but <laughs> mm. hello sorry that was jamal he was asking if he should pick up dinner tonight but i told him no so all right so whew, this was really really good you guys such an easy dinner like you guys saw i literally just threw the chicken in the microwave i made the sides on the stove um you know you can do any type of vegetable that's low carb like broccoli or carrots you know don't go overboard with them don't eat a lot don't eat too much of it but you can have carrots and broccoli and cauliflower when you're doing keto or low carb they are one of the low carb vegetables but again just don't go overboard i like to just mention that and then my cauliflower rice so okay this is what i'm having so i'm gonna put this aside i'll just throw it in the microwave whenever micah micah jamal gets home and i have strawberries in the refrigerator so maybe for dinner because it's still pretty early it's it's like 7 15 so um maybe i'll have some strawberries for dessert tonight so we shall see so hopefully you guys will try this dinner i get the kevin's food brand from my uh, local fresh time store which is like a whole foods but i've actually seen them at my other local grocery store giant eagle so check your local grocery store try the kevin's brand i personally think it's so easy and quick to make and it's really really good i've had the thai curry and then this is the cilantro lime and they've both been both been so good so okay so i did so good today you guys today was a really good low carb day i haven't been this good in weeks so i'm so proud of myself and i managed to stay under 30 grams of net carbs today with breakfast snack lunch dinner so it just feels good yeah, I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys can get a few ideas um, for my low carb eats today, staying under 30 grams of net carbs. I did manage to drink six of those um, water, not water, six of those Starbucks cups filled with water. I had six of them today, so I did really good with the water. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye! Yay. Bye! Yay.